Right, hi all. Tail tidies, this time the production version. Finished welding them up today, so they're ready to go off to be etch primed and powder coated. A nice matte black they're going to be. Over the original prototype one that I did, it has got a fitment for the OEM indicators, as you can see. There's a little spacer that comes with them to, to go in there, so you can fit the Oh yeah, mine's like a little ring thing because it's, it's thinner than the plastic that comes out with it's sort of quite a chunky bit of plastic in that they fitted into. So I swapped those over and then you can also run the spacer kits in. Then there's a slightly different spacer kit, thinner to allow fitment if you do want to fit these ones. The This design obviously requires the keeping this, uh, the, the, the handle. There's a few people said there's just going to be a bolt on option it's not going to be any good if you do you've got to cut something uh, and it's going to cut this bit this is a nice bit that Yamaha have made they've obviously spent a lot of money making the tooling for this uh, section goes all the way up underneath there nice thick quality plastic you can cut the back end of that get a nice finish on it pretty simple to do I've ordered some for stock uh, this section we can also send them out for a 10 quid fee of them pre-cut just waiting for the stocks to come in on those and they can go out with the tail tidy if you want to or I'll do a video showing where exactly where to cut it it's nice and easy uh, where to do it these will be in the LED number plate lights within the next couple of days there'll be some connections for that that's the only bit that is really fiddly to do uh, connect that up because you've got to use the plug from the original one I've been unable thus far to find the female three pin plug uh, to purchase. If I can, then I'll just do them um, and include them in with the kit. At the moment, you've got to reuse the original one, but that's the only one to do. The indicators, the standard ones, OEM ones just plug straight into the loom on the other side of the bike. Uh, these ones, there's a little extension loom kit that'll be on the shop uh, and you can just plug them straight in as well. So they don't need any changes to the wiring, just plug and play. So the original ones, the only one that isn't at the moment is the number plate light. I'm looking to uh, sort that out, but the reality is it's not going to happen straight away. So uh, for the time being, there'll be a couple of little connectors supplied uh, and you'll just have to reuse the original plug. This bit will be supplied as well, along with the, along with the fixings. Um, that uh, supports the rear light because you need that because it's a bit wobbly. Otherwise, the rear light, the OEM one from Yamaha this bit that you cut off actually supports the bottom of this light so this just replicates that uh, and helps bolt on the uh, um, the uh, section uh, through into it to hold it into the steel work adds a load of strength to it it's a strong little setup this I wanted a uh, like an actual little mud guard rather than just a tail tidy that was thin and spindly and allow well basically relied on the number plate as your Fend, you know, as your fender and your mud guard, I didn't think that was right. So this works really well. I've had it and and tried it. The wiring, and if you can see that, oh, knock that off of there. If you can see that, not very well really. But the wiring goes up. It tucks un, up underneath the steel section and goes through. Um, the there's grommets uh, that come with the kit uh, for here. Just waiting for some of those to turn up. They'll be available on the web shop to pre-order. Um, this evening I'll try to keep the price as competitive as possible really uh, it's a pretty simple part to make it's a little bit fiddly there's just sort of running about to do and um, but I've kept them they're gonna be 39.95 uh, which I think is pretty reasonable for the for the kit um, but uh, yeah I'll um, I'll bung them up there on the shop uh, tonight and hopefully you like them thanks a lot bye